I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw Eleanor Roosevelt, first lady of the world. I take one finger right here in the center and I put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw a flat oval. I come on the left hand side and I draw a straight line down. I come on the right hand side I draw another straight line down. But I come right here in the center and I put a dot. We're going to draw a straight line over, straight line down, straight line out, straight line down, straight line in, straight line down, straight line over, and leave it floating. Come back to the dot, straight line down, straight line out, straight line down, straight line in, straight line down, connect. Starting right here at this corner, we're just going to draw a straight diagonal up, straight line down, straight diagonal in, connect, jump over to the left hand side, straight diagonal out, straight line down, straight diagonal in, connect. Now come back to the left hand side and just extend a little straight line, slightly curved line, straight line up, connect. Come back to the left. Straight diagonal out, big curved line, straight diagonal up, connect. Starting right here on the left, we're just going to draw a straight line, curve line out, curve line in. Come on the right hand side, straight line down, curve line out, curve line in, connect. Come right here on the left, we're just going to draw a straight line, slightly curved line, straight line up, Connect and right down here in the center put a dot. We're going to draw a straight line up, straight line over, straight line down, straight line out, straight line down, straight line in, straight line down, straight line in, and leave it floating. Come back to the dot, straight line out, straight line down, straight line in, straight line down, connect. Come on the right hand side, we're just going to draw a straight diagonal down, curve line up, connect on the right, straight diagonal down, curve line up, connect on the left. Right at this point, straight line, curve line off the page, left hand side, straight line, curve line off the page. Come back over here inside and we're just going to draw, let's do this part first, little curve line out in on the right little curve line out in on the left. Curve line, curve line, little curve line back, connect, little curve line back, connect, little curve line inside, inside, straight diagonal curve line, big curve line, big curve line, skinny curve line, connect. Come over here on the left and we're just going to go wavy, wavy line on the left, wavy, wavy line on the right. Come down, wavy, wavy line on the left, wavy, wavy line on the right. Okay, I picked this picture of Eleanor. We're going to write a bunch of stuff because she was really important. Eleanor Roosevelt. Okay. She was born in 1884 and died in 1962, okay? She, in this outfit, is part of the American Red Cross, which was a really big deal because nobody, no woman especially, had joined up during World War II. She was married to President Franklin Delano Roosevelt. They called him FDR. And she was considered the first 
lady of the world. Because what happened was FDR, president, had polio and he told Eleanor, you're going to have to be my arm, my legs to walk around and see what's really going on in the country and the world. So she also was part of the United Nations. She was an activist, meaning if she saw something that wasn't right, she spoke up. She was for civil rights. And she had six children. A busy lady. Okay, let's see how we're going to color her in. Okay, being a member of the Red Cross was a big deal because, one, she was being FDR's eyes and legs around the world. And it was under the auspices of the Red Cross that she went and did a lot of her travels. The other thing is, we were in the middle of World War II, and she's not a young woman, so I'm going to give her some gray hair. She's not a young person, but that did not stop her from going and visiting the Pacific uh, area of the war to visit the sailors and the Americans that were fighting that whole war over on that side. I'm using peach just to give her a little bit of color. But, pink for lips, because she was in the Pacific, her uniform was white, okay? And she had very blue eyes, so we'll give her blue eyes. Anyways, it was so unusual for a woman to do that, but she did it because FDR asked her to, and she was an activist. She didn't just sit around. And it was highly unusual for a first lady. Okay, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here's Eleanor Roosevelt all colored in. First lady of the world, but also our first modern first lady. Outstanding woman. Read about her. Really cool. Okay. Bye-bye.